Okay, hello again, everyone. Today I'm going to be talking about uh, what exactly the word procedural means in regards to Blender. Basically, it just means something that's generated algorithmically or using math instead of being made manually by a person. In the context of textures, as an example, regular textures, like the ones used on this material here, I guess it's supposed to be concrete, but it looks more like wet paper. Those textures are just a PNG image that I saved on my computer. You can see it right here. And I have that image plugged into the shader to project onto the cube here. Uh, on the other cube, I made something that looks kind of similar, but is actually made with procedural textures. And uh, they are procedural because there is no image file. These are being generated in Blender in real time. And you can see if we mess around with the sliders, it will change the way that they look. Uh, and that's kind of all there is to it. Down here I have a few examples of other procedurally generated textures that are in Blender. Uh, you can see that when we project them onto our object, uh, we can change how they look, slide these around to make tons of different appearances. And while this is a really simple example, there are plenty of materials that you'll see, probably downloadable online, where you'll get a uh, procedural concrete or procedural marble table or something. And you'll get materials that will combine dozens of these textures into a final result that looks like pretty much anything you want. And the beautiful thing is that with these, you can either leave them how you get it right when you download it, or you can always tweak any of these values to totally change up the appearance of anything whenever you want. It's great. Get used to using it. You'll thank yourself later. Anyway, didn't want this to be a guide or anything, just a really quick answer to a simple question that might have confused some very new people. So if there's anything you want to see a video made on, let me know in the comments and I will do my best. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.